As recent as last week, Heritage Hills was ranked number one in the state for 3A in boys basketball, but that didn't last after suffering a buzzer-beating loss to Pike Central. In all fairness, it was arguably the Chargers' best performance of the year. The Patriots have recognized that, especially when they have a top 60 recruit nationally in Trent Sisley, that they're going to get every opponent's best effort. It's the target on their back that they think is the best way to prepare them for the postseason. People are playing, you know, some of their best games of the year against us. So, you know, be able, to, you know, take their punches, but also, you know, be able to perform and stuff and um, translate that to wins is good. People got to circle on the calendar, so we got to show up every game, no matter home or away, and just be ready to play. Uh, I think our kids understand there's a level uh, that they have to they have to attain and have to reach every single night because, uh, yeah, I mean, you know, good team, good player in, in trend on our team. Uh, so yeah, I mean, we have had to go through and get everybody's best shot. What pressed a lot more. Um, that, that speeds some teams up and, and kind of scares them a little bit with our length. We've just we've we've really dialed in on, on um, other teams. They'll be tested again in a PAC rivalry matchup against Southridge tomorrow night. The Screaming Eagles.